I moved out to LA when I was eight years old to pursue acting, singing, and dancing. My main goal was to do acting and dancing, but now that I'm older, I have kind of moved on to the singing route, which I love. I'm very happy that I did because singing is like one of my favorite things ever. I released Afterglow, I'd say kind of more in the summer of 2021. I released Exposed during, I would say in October, I think it was October. I actually have a new song coming out, it's called Trust Issues. So me and my family, we always talk about how all three of those songs kind of go together because Afterglow is about being in this new awesome relationship and like everything is just wonderful and then exposed is more about trying to open up like it being really hard because you're in a bad relationship like before so now you don't really know how to open up and like expose your heart and then trust issues is obviously it's pretty obvious it's trust issues so we always talk about how those three songs like go very well together and how we like how I released the songs in order, like Afterglow, then Exposed, then Trust Issues. So I'm really excited for everybody to hear the new song, because uh, it's definitely my favorite out of the three. This month, I'm not really too sure on a set date, but I do know that it comes out in January of 2022. I actually just saw the trailer for it. I'm so excited for it to come out. It is called The Hyperions. I played a younger version of Penelope Mitchell, and I am in the movie with Carrie Elwes, but it's coming out in February. I'm also not sure on a set date for that. They haven't told me yet, but I'm super excited, and I know all of my friends are super excited, and my family, so yeah, make sure you guys go watch it. Well, Charmers released last year, I'd say around May, but it is definitely a role that it's like not my biggest role but it's a role that I'm like a very reoccurring character I'm in every episode I play the mean girl I'm okay. Paris which is so awesome and I play the mean girl mainly towards my best friend in real life but we're enemies on the show which is so fun to play um but yeah it's like one of my favorite characters to play because it's a mean girl and obviously playing a mean girl on a tv show is like such a fun thing to do so <laughs> i've actually been a reoccurring character or not character i'd say dancer uh for four years which is so awesome and i have met a lot of friends on this show and it's just been so fun i haven't really been able to do it since covid obviously but it was such a fun role to play like dancing with everybody it was just so amazing also i got to meet christina applegate but she is super nice you can you can also find me on my instagram and tiktok and i also have a snapchat account now my parents they help me a lot they help like scheduling and they do give me a lot of free time where i can just chillax and read a book or like watch tv and they plan a bunch of like fun days with my friends which is also awesome because i am a content creator so i do fun stuff all the time but then i also do have days where i have to work and like really work hard definitely don't listen to the haters the people that are commenting all of these hate comments that are definitely trying to get some sort of attention from the person that they're commenting them towards because if you truly just don't like someone you wouldn't want to like express it to them you would just leave them alone definitely don't respond to the hate or listen to it everybody has different taste in music everybody has different taste in style so if i put a song out that someone doesn't like it's okay because that's not their type of music everybody has different taste in anything you do so just listen to yourself thank you so much for having me